I play G Dorian, I'm essentially playing the E Locrian mode, which is what we probably were all taught. Which sounds great. The E melodic minor, I mean the G melodic minor sounds really great too. And that gives us um, one difference. In other words, the difference between playing G Dorian and G melodic minor is just one pitch. So instead of an F natural, we have an F sharp. But it makes all the difference. So we have two full measures of G minor 7. So instead of just staying on G minor, I was playing things like this. So what that is, is me bouncing back and forth between G minor, the chord that it is, and D7, flat 9, the five of it. Fourths. So there's a voicing in fourths. And that's me, uh, and that's the sound of it harmonized. And it's fun to blow on those kind of sounds, for instance. And what you heard there at the end was the D7, going to the G minor, where we are in the song. But another sound that gets used a lot, you know, I do it myself uh, as well, is Spilidian sound here. So what you just heard there was E major pentatonic over this D major chord. But if I take the typical Joe Pass thing, and he would play A minor a 2 5, he would do things like this. So his 2 5 consisted of a drop 2 shape like this, A minor 7 flat 5. And then moving it up a minor third, giving the sound of an altered dominant. And that works every time.
Thank you.